Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So in this video, we're going to continue our discussion in random board exam problem. So this is problem number 36. Once again guys, if you're new to this channel, just click the subscribe button and then yung notification bell so that you'll get notified on our future videos such as this one. So this is part of analytic geometry and uh, this can uh, come out sa mga engineering board examination. So this problem basically is just uh, concerned about the fundamental concepts. So this is the concept of a chord of a circle. So a circle is described by the equation x squared plus y squared minus 16x equal 0, calculate the length of the curve that is 4 units from the center of the circle. So first, let's plot the circle and then let's compute for the length of the chord. So ang chord is just a line segment that connects two points in the circumference of a circle. So if you know the definition of a chord, so mas madali mo siyang masusol. So this is from the fundamental concepts. So first, hanapin natin yung center ng circle natin. Diba? So yung ating circle is in the form, so x minus h squared plus y minus k quantity squared is equal to r squared. So ito yung form natin guys. No? So h and k uh, are or is the coordinate of the center of the circle. So basically, kailangan nating mag-complete squared dyan sa x and then sa y. Okay? So, x squared minus 16x. So, pagsamahin natin, guys, yung uh, may mga x at yung may mga y. So, plus blank. So, kailangan natin i-complete square yan. And then, plus y squared. Okay? Equals 0. So, dito, na as you can observe, ang, pwede lang, ang kailangan lang natin i-complete square dyan is yung my x, okay? So, kasi yung y squared, okay na siya. So, 0 yung k natin dun. So, wala siyang constant dito. Okay? So, here, kailangan natin makomplete square to. So, paano tayo nag-complete square? Balikan lang natin, no? So, we have here the coefficient of uh, x, yung first degree. Okay? As you can see, 16 siya, di ba? So, i-divide lang natin to sa 2, guys. So, 16 divided by 2 is 8. Okay? So, basically, ito ay... 8 squared. Okay? So, since nag-add ka ng 8 squared dyan, you should also add 8 squared here. And then, yung complete square expression nyo, yung naka-factor na, that is x. So, since ito guys, minus to. So, ito minus din dito. So, x minus 8 quantity squared plus y squared. Okay, pwede mo lagyan ng 0 para... Mas okay yung form natin, no? So, pwede mong ilagay yung 2 dito sa labas. So, same expression. Equals 8 squared. So, in this case, we can observe that h is 8. Okay, h is 8. And then you have k as 0. And then yung r natin, radius is 8. So, we can see here that our... Center of the circle is located at 8, 0. So, ipaplot na lang natin siya, guys. Okay. So, ito na yung naplot natin, no? So, yung center natin is at 8, 0. And then, yung radius natin dito, guys, is, as we have solved earlier, that is 8. Okay? So, we have here, so, this radius here is 8. And then, of course, this is also 8 here. And then, ang question natin is that the length of the chord that is 4 units from the center of the circle. So, if this is the center, so you have 1, 2, 3, 4. Ayan. That's 4 units from the center. So, ito na yung chord natin. Okay? So, we have this uh, chord here. So, the definition of a chord is that it is a line segment that connects two points on your circumference. Okay, so ito ay 4 units here, from here to here. It's 4 units. 
So, let's say, ito ay A. Ito ay A. So, hati natin sa dalawa para makompute natin siya using the Pythagorean theorem. So, this is your radius here. So, same lang siya dito. So, that is 8. Okay? And the length of the chord, so let's say L, is just equal to 2 times A. Okay? Kasi itong dalawa, hinati lang natin. Okay? So, length of the chord is 2A. So, we can compute A here using the Pythagorean theorem because this is a right angle here. So, 8 squared is equal to 4 squared plus A squared. So, basically, A is just equal to the square root of 8 squared minus 4 squared. Ayan. So, i-compute lang natin siya guys using our calculator. Ayan. Compute lang natin. No? So, square root of 8 squared plus, sorry, that is minus 4 squared. So, equals lang natin. So, 4 square root of 3. Okay? 4 square root of 3 ang A natin. So, syempre, ang length of chord natin, that is 2 times A. So, A is 4 square root of 3. So, we have here, length of the chord is 8 square root of 3. Times 2 lang natin to guys. No? Times 2. So, equals. And then, SD lang natin. That's equal to 13.856. Okay? So, length of the chord is 13.856 units. Okay, so this is now your final answer for this problem. And so basta alam natin guys yung basics, fundamentals, we can solve these kinds of problem. So let's go back to the choices we have here, letter C. And pag lumabas siya guys sa board exam, at least you know how to solve this problem. So that's it guys for today's video. No? So in the next videos, we are going to solve more board exam problem para ma-expose kayo sa mga gantong problem para, ayun, ma-develop ma nyo yung fundamental or basic knowledge nyo regarding sa mathematics. Okay? So, thank you guys for watching this video and see you on my next video. Bye-bye!